The month of May has been declared Sexual Assault Awareness Month in the hopes of getting people to report sexual assaults. Statistically, only one in ten sexual assaults are ever reported. The courage of the women, the men, the children, and families that report sexual violence, not only to police agencies, but to our dedicated community service partners. Seneca College students have joined forces with the Toronto Police Service to make a graphic campaign explaining what sexual assault is. One of the things that uh, we've learned is that uh, it takes a lot of courage to come forward and uh, report sexual assault. And uh, the Toronto Police has been very fortunate enough to work with a certain individual who has shown such courage. Her name is Carlin Priscilla. She is a sexual assault sur uh, survivor. She dedicates her time in raising awareness against sexual assault in hopes that uh, others will come forward and do the same that thing. In 2013, we're still blaming the victim and there's still that protection of the perpetrator. Um, I'm not condoning what they did, but why do they do it? I know there's that side of it, but also why are we protecting them and not protecting the victim? So it's, it's, it has to be a, a cultural shift. It cannot just be me or another victim speaking out about it. It has to be everybody. We have to start sharing the story. We have to start saying, this happened to me. This is how I felt in order for us to really provide a ground or a platform for others to get the help they need. My plea to everybody out there is to create that culture of acceptance and, 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 and to break the silence. Give other people the permission for them to speak. Support them. Believe them. Give them that help. Give them that hand and support us. For the Toronto Sun, I'm Kevin Connor.